Hey guys, it's Jimmy Jones. Yeah, I was just telling my girl a little story about when I was a kid. About how I used to dress up like Michael Jackson. Now I'm dressed up like this dancer right now. <laughs> I can wear my girl's pants and shit. And uh, so we were, I was telling her a story about how when, when I was a kid, I used to dress up like Michael Jackson and go to the park. And... Um, I used to dance, and people would like throw me money and shit. And it was just, like, to me, it was a big deal. I loved Michael, you know. And then my my uh, my babysitter's uh, brother, he had told me, he's like, when you get older, you're not gonna like Michael Jackson no more. Um, he's like, you're gonna like clothes, you're gonna like to hang out with your friends, you're not gonna want to buy toys. And he said that. Um, he said, Michael Jackson's gay. And I got all offended, got a little heart broke, and I was like, no, he's not, Michael Jackson is not gay. And this was like during the time of the first, you know, accusation. So, I mean, it was probably around the time I was really young. I just remember it hurt me. I love Michael. And, uh, you know, if, if I want to uh, listen to the, the music that I grew up listening to and uh, that wasn't a part of my life in my childhood and experiencing people bullying on me and people, you know, getting their opinion in my head, you know, I might not be where I'm at today. And today, I get to come into my own studio and I get to make the music I choose to make that the influences that I've had over the years, you know, for every person you listen to, every little person in your life, every single song you listen to, every single movie you watch is influencing your brain. Choose wisely on what influences your brain. You want to make sure that you're tip-top magoo. You don't want to be fall victim to no silly dumb shit you know I've trust me I've been around the ringer and I've been through a lot of situations I could have avoided situations I put myself in and I know things could have been a lot different Dashcoin 64 But yeah, so today is a lot different. Oh, I know you're still And um, so I I choose to try to put myself around people that are very positive, very influential people. You know, I don't really I don't like to judge people because everybody's been through their ups and downs. Everybody goes through struggles. I don't believe that you have money and you don't have problems. Trust me, the more money I get, the more problems I got. And I believe to pay it forward and try to help those who, you know, they have a dream, but you gotta work for yourself. You gotta, you, you can't have your vision to work for somebody else your whole life. You know, you gotta try to go in there and do what you wanna do, that whatever makes you happy. You gotta find what it is that you like to do. Whatever it is that really you feel content, that your heart feels satisfied doing, that you have without no doubt, like this is what I'm supposed to do. Those are the types of things you gotta go with your gut. You gotta go with your gut instinct and take risks, take chances, don't be afraid. It's hard not to be afraid, especially when you're going into deals. I'm going into a deal tomorrow. It's unlike any deal that I, you know I've ever had in my life, and you know I'm choosing to take it the best possible way by keeping my my head and my mind clear and trying to do what I feel is best for the rest of my life because I know that these decisions now are gonna affect me later on in 20, 30 years from now if I live that long that I'm gonna be looking back now when I'm in the prime of my life 
that these are the opportunities that I have and I have to take those opportunities now while they're there because they will not always be there trust that don't take it for granted you get somebody that offers you to work overtime and you don't take that opportunity don't take that the for granted if somebody offers you a little side job and you're like you know what I'm tired tonight I worked all day I don't want to make no extra money I'm tired I'd rather go to sleep at the end of the week yeah you might feel a little rested but you can sleep at the end of the week take that time for yourself to get your own life in order I take anything that possible to try to get to the, the places where I want to be I don't want to just be satisfied with a content life and wish that I would have done the things that that really make me happy you know I don't want to be looking back on my life and be like I could have done this I could have done that I don't want to look back with regret and I'm filming and documenting everything along my journey to try to help other people try and inspire them to document my life so I can look back and remember these times and also my family my friends people that were a part of my life when I pass on they will have something to remember me by and they will remember that they were a part of something whatever it is that I got going on <laughs> they were a part of it and uh, a shout out to everybody that is family you know who you are if I consider you family you're my family I am Mark we are all art life is beautiful make it that way take that that moment in the day to push that little extra bit where you you feel a little fatigued remember man I can do this shit I got this shit I ain't worried about shit this ain't shit I'm a motherfucking hustle harder I'm gonna get done by this this project that they're giving me this the date that I need it done by man I got this same shit just do what you gotta do to be where you wanna be I love you I hope I inspire somebody and uh, peace love and happiness bye guys